you guys see I'm unboxing this 10th gen core i3 I'm going to be using this in a new rig that I'm going to be doing um, so yeah so I bought an i5 last time and I was like well I could probably get away with an i3 uh, anyway so check this out here's the back we're going to unbox this um, as you can see here's the specs so it is a core i3 uh, 10 100F, so LGA 1200, and this is a quad core CPU. So I remember when the old i7s were quad core. So now, you know, i7s are generally going to be like. So, all right, so what's up? Now this does come with an Intel cooler, which is cool. It's all the newer stuff. You don't have the coolers anymore because they want to save money. Uh, if you don't overclock, an Intel stock cooler is fine. But, so. Um, and I'm not, I, I need a low profile cooler anyways when I make rigs. So, and this is what's in there. So, let's take a look. Okay, so here's the chip itself. Here's the cooler. It does have pre applied thermal base. So. Check that out. Here's the pre applied thermal base. But you have to remember, this is sitting in the warehouse for a while. So, it looks kind of old. The thermal base, like, it really needs probably a refresh. So, um, but here's the stock cooler. It's decent, so. They wouldn't give it to you if it didn't work. So here's the chip itself, here's the i3. It's actually a really nice chip. Um, it doesn't have a lot of pins or anything. Oh, it has to hold them. But, um, but yeah, it's not really big or anything. It's nice, so. Yeah, pretty simple, pretty simple. So, um, yeah. If you have any questions, comments, guys, please subscribe to the channel.